One feature of a Cuba Backup Professional is to allow you to automatically store the backup on a remote location. Dropbox is a very popular option as it provides you with two gigabytes of cloud storage space free of charge. And it's very simple with a Kiba Backup Professional to configure your backups to be saved into your Dropbox folder. To begin, go to the configuration and scroll down to the data processing engine. Here you can see many options including Upload to Dropbox. Once that's selected, choose Configure. In order for our website to talk to Dropbox, we need to do a two-step authentication. Once the first step is complete, we can close the pop-up window and do the second step. As you can see, a token and a secret key have been automatically completed. The directory with that we want to store it in is by default the root of our Dropbox account, but we can store it anywhere we want, including a subdirectory. Once you have configured Dropbox, save and close your configuration and you are now ready to perform your first backup with the files being saved on Dropbox. Once the backup has completed, we can go to our Manage Backups and we, here we can see that the backup just took place, it's a remote backup and it's stored remotely. From this link, we are able to bring the backup back from Dropbox directly onto our web server. Now, every time a backup is performed by a Kiba Backup Professional, the backup file itself is being stored remotely in our Dropbox accounts.